So I have three rafts here and I'm going to use them to demonstrate a common issue that I see with raft building. And we're going to go over to our first raft here. And as I come up the rampway and go inside, what you'll notice is I can't go inside. I can walk all the way around the edges of it just about, but I can't actually get into the raft, not without crouching. Once I crouch, then I can walk around. Come out here, I can stand up again, right? Going over to our second raft, which is built in nearly an identical manner, I can walk right in, no problems. Okay. Now, the problem with the first raft is that this decking is showing because this decking actually bumps you up a little bit. It makes you effectively a little bit taller, so you can't really fit inside. Now on our second raft, you'll see that that is not an issue. The decking is almost entirely hidden, except for this little strip of wood right here at the, at the back of the raft, or front if you, if you rather. Now I'm gonna show you how that becomes an issue. This'll be our little demo raft to demonstrate what's, what's gone wrong here. So the old way to sink a foundation on a raft was to do it much the same way that you do it on the land. And that was to take out a pillar and it could be wood or it could be stone and you get it pretty much as well lined up as you can. You could use this sort of to insta line you up, kind of like that. I don't find that works so well. But you slap your pillar down and then to one side of it, you put down a foundation. On top of that, you snap down another pillar and then another foundation next to that. Now there's a couple of problems with this older method of sinking foundations on a raft. One, that's about as low as you can go without some without wasting a lot of materials. Two, this is already wasting a lot of materials. If you're playing on official or even just a fairly normal unofficial server without really boosted uh, stats, ratings, what, whatever, XP, uh, rates, that sort of thing. You, you ain't going to be wasting your time with, with wasting materials. You can do that on single player because you can, you know, God mode, have infinite materials, infinite weight. That's fine, right? And, and another thing you're, you're probably not going to be doing on, say, an official server, especially not on a PvP one, is you're probably not going to be making a two-story raft right away because that's almost twice as much materials to get that second story up. Well, not twice as much, but you got to do a whole nother ring of walls. It's more time, it's more materials. So a lot of rafts, if you want to build a raft quickly, something that'll just keep some of your stuff in it, get you around, you're going to be making a one story raft and you're going to be trying to hammer out a raft as quickly as possible. Um, if you if you are making a two-story raft, uh, the height thing with having that decking showing probably is an issue. But for a lot of people, it is it it is going to be an issue. So we'll go ahead and we'll demolish these right here. I don't have any of those fancy mods installed, like the gun that zaps things and doesn't leave any uh, <laughs> rubble behind. But that's all right. So the new method of doing it, which is a lot more effective, is uh, to use a fence foundation, right? So you get your fence foundation snapped, okay? And you try to line one of the holes of the fence foundation up with the hole in the raft. Now I first learned this trick from a channel called Impossible Lag but there was something that that channel did not address in that video. And once you got this down, 
you're going to take a pillar and you're going to snap it to that. And then once you have your pillar down, of course, you'll take your foundation and oh, look at that. It snapped pretty much as low as it can go. It can go a little lower than that, I believe. But our decking is showing. Hmm. Okay. So that's kind of a problem if we wanted to uh, not have that space issue inside. So we'll get rid of this foundation and get rid of this pillar. And we'll get rid of this fence foundation. We'll get out another fence foundation. Now, the way I've seen it in another video that was actually recently posted to Reddit, and it's a kind of a pirate ship build. Uh, the quality of the build otherwise aside, I noticed the guy, he, he puts the foundation down this way, okay? Like that. And then he snaps his pillar. Now he snaps his pillar here. And what you get as a result of that is again, you get the foundation underneath the planks, which is a little too low. Doesn't need to be that low to protect the boat. And it does cause that, that single story issue if you're building a single story raft. So go ahead and pick that back up. We'll pick up this stone pillar. We'll demolish this fence. Oh, well, actually, wait, we'll wait on that. Now, now here's the thing. You, you can put it this way, okay? And you get your pillar out and you snap it to the outside. So not this inside snap point, you snap it right there. And then, oh, look at that. See that little hair of wood that's showing there, just like on a raft that actually works? That'll make it so that you can actually use this this way. Okay, so we'll just uh, go ahead, uh, pick that back up, pick our pillar back up, and we'll get rid of that foundation. Pull out another foundation. So, so that's the way you can do it with the foundation facing sideways if you're more comfortable lining it up that way, okay? Now the way you can do it with the foundation sticking off the edge is that you just can't put it out too far. You can put it to the first hole lining up with the raft uh, sail hole, <clears throat> or you can put it to the second hole with the raft lining up with the sail hole. But what you can't do is put it to the third or the fourth hole. The fourth hole is actually even hard, hard to get. You have to kind of like that. So we'll go ahead and we'll just snap it as far out as you reasonably should be able to snap it. That's that second hole lined up with the hole for the raft sail. Now we'll go ahead and we'll put, uh, there it is, boom. There's our pillar. And notice that the pillar snapped to the outside. It's not snapped on the inside, it's snapped to the outside, okay? Go ahead and look at that. Our foundation is right where we want it to be. There's the line. And so that's the thing.